Welcome on this beautiful day today. And guess what? This is not Gary Bingaman talking. This is John Dietrich speaking today on It's Your Money Radio, where you can, like we said, we can help you make more money, save more money, and have more money for all of your financial goals. How do we do that? We do that by interviewing people locally from the Springfield community who are in the business of serving you and giving you the advice you need to make better decisions in purchasing while I can give you better decisions and if you need help with your budgeting, if you need help with your investing, and uh, especially now that it's tax season, you need help with your taxes, then I'm the guy to call. And uh, of course, you can reach the show today if you want to call in, 862-9977 is the number. Today our guest, our, our guest here is Michael Miller. Hello. Say hello. Tell, hello. Introduce yourself. Hello. Introduce yourself. Hello, well, I'm Dr. Michael Miller, uh, <coughs> back in Neck Care Center here, local uh, chiropractic clinic. Um, we are on two uh, streets here in town. We currently have two clinics, but here in February, the big news is we're going to be consolidating two clinics into one, and the new office location is going to be 3100 South National. That's on the corner of Montclair and National, right over there in the Medical Mile. You know that little strip of I do. medical so, places. Yeah. So both of your current locations are closing. That's correct. And, and you'll have one new location consolidating right. in one place right there at the Medical Mile. Where, That's right. Where people are going to be helped all the time. Brand new clinic, uh, plenty of room for everybody. We'll have physical therapy available. Of course, we do acupuncture there. We also do nutrition, and I do a whole lot of the nutrition, nutrition response testing, where I can figure out the person's, oh, the best nutritional things that they need as compared to spending a whole lot of extra money on uh, nutritional supplements that are not doing them any good. So I can find, figure that all out for them. And usually it costs, oh, a good $85 for the first examination, but through this radio show, we're offering a $49 examination that will include your consultation, your examination, and area x-ray if needed, and we will give you a report of findings thereafter, all for that $49. So if you call in to the radio show, we will take your information and mail you a certificate so that you can make your appointment and get that bonus deal. That sounds like a pretty good deal. Now, how can they reach you in the meantime if they need to, uh, need to get a hold of you? Do you yeah. still have the same phone numbers? Yeah, the same phone number. That is going to be 417-889-2225. Again, that is 889-2225. And ask for Dr. Miller when you make an appointment uh, or any, if you need any information. Megan and Carrie are over there you know, man on the phones most of the time, they can give you any other information that you need. But by all means, especially if you hear it on this radio show, ask for Dr. Miller over there, and we will get you set up with an appointment just as soon as possible. Okay, great. Now, uh, yes, yeah, so you can uh, always give Dr. Miller a call, or you can uh, talk to him today if you have any questions. And Dr. Miller will be talking today about general chiropractic acupuncture health and uh, those ketone supplements that we've been talking about before which are very good so that'll be later on and uh, you can give us a call anytime 862-9977 uh, or if you're calling from out of state and listening to the program on Facebook live um, if you want to listen to us on Facebook live search at your money radio and you will find our website and you'll be able to watch us live if you're calling from out of state, you can reach us at 1-800-375-0056. So we're looking forward to your calls today. And on any question that you have on health care, anything, even insurance, uh, how insurance works with uh, chiropractic care, so on and so forth. If you have any health concerns, be sure to give us a call. We can answer some of those questions today. And if, uh, if Gary Bingaman were here today, he would tell you that what a day... What a day for amazing weather, right? We have, we went from 60, and we're going to get down to about 15 degrees around a little later today, and then we got a little bit of rain, we'll have a little bit of freezing, 
and uh, watch out if your pipes are prone oh. to freezing. Get mm -hmm. a little bit of them, get them running, get the one furthest from your uh, source of water in your house and keep that water on a trickle so that your pipes don't, won't freeze. That'll help prevent them from freezing. Keep the heat on and uh, keep that house nice and toasty. I know that we're keeping our house nice and toasty with those beautiful gas logs that we purchased and mm -hmm. had installed by a and Heating and Air, Mechan mm -hmm. a and Mechanical Heating and Air Conditioning and Plumbing is all they do. And uh, my wife has had those logs burning all morning down in the basement, <laughs> keeping toasty warm. And good. our house is going to be toasty warm no matter how cold it gets. So we really like our gas logs. We got them in two different fireplaces. And, and we ordered them and got them uh, from Amazon. And Gary installed them. And he he's did a fine job. He got them installed, and both of them, and all in one day, ran mm -hmm. the gas pipe, gas lines, and everything. Gave me a really fair deal, just wow. like he would to anyone else. So. Uh, but, uh, you know, I was thinking today about your furnace, and uh, I think a lot of people take your heat for granted. Oh, now, yeah, well, yeah, until we don't have it. Until you don't have it, right. <laughs> so, right. you know, I challenge you to go home, and now it's going to be nice and cold. Turn your heat off tonight and see how you feel. I don't mm -hmm. really recommend that <laughs> because you know you'd be really cold. Mm -hmm. But what are you going to do when it goes out of service? And yep. then it'll be, then you don't have a choice but have no heat on a cold night like mm -hmm. tonight. So uh, give Gary a call at A&D Mechanical Services at 866-8257 and get your units serviced. Yeah, don't forget about the carbon monoxide problem because when you shut up everything, mm -hmm. we're going to be, you know, you're going to keep everything shut up. And if you do have a bad heat exchanger, and you will start leaking the carbon monoxide, and well, that's a bad one. So that's you a wanna, big risk. You want to have those things checked regularly, and, and Gary can do that very yeah. really good. They carry a very sensitive carbon monoxide detector around, mm -hmm. and they'll be able to tell you how many parts per million your air is and what's safe, yep. and yep. whether you should be worried about that. You should have a carbon monoxide detector in your house. You can get those real cheap on Amazon yeah. for under 20 bucks. Yeah. The, and, other day, um, the other day, I had a... My, the heater in the house did not come on, and we were freezing. It was like, okay, what's the matter with this? Why didn't why is the heater working? Well, the safety things on the heater itself turned off because there was a bad heat exchanger. Wow. So all of a sudden, you're waking up and you're everybody's freezing, and then your pipes could be freezing and bursting. Mm -hmm. And all of a sudden, yeah, you don't want that to happen at the coldest day yeah. of the year. Well, and remember that A&D Mechanical is a 24-hour emergency service, mm -hmm. and you can reach them at 866-8257. So give them a call, and uh, they'll help you over the phone. I, I like their service. The reason I like Gary on the show, you know, he likes to come on, and he'll talk to you, and if it's something simple that you can fix yourself, you don't have to spend a bunch of money, you know, for a... Uh, you know, for a serviceman to come out to your house and charge you their minimum fee and travel and all that, he can help you solve the problem over the phone if that's yeah. all it takes. So they're yeah. really good people. They'll help keep your costs down and they'll take care of you really well. So uh, looks like we have a phone call. Who's this? We've got Deborah calling from Rogersville. Deborah, what can we do for you? Okay, I would just like to ask uh, some questions. What type of chiropractic uh, manipulation? Well, I do a full spine, and I use Thompson technique, basically. That's using the drop tables, and that is a technique that goes from the bottom of the, in the pelvis and takes into account sacrum all the way up to the top of the head. So it's a full spine adjustment um, using the drop tables. And it is a very more, I'll say, more comfortable for a patient um, because everything is so fast with the drop pieces. Um, I do have an activator, and I do use it on some people's extremities. It depends on how severe they are in pain when they start care. Um, but I also use diversified techniques, so there's a variety of ways that it can help. Well, my problem that I'm having right now is mm -hmm. um, my right arm, my fingers, 
Oh, uh-huh. And, uh, I'm thinking it's kind of in that number 11. Yeah. That's kind of where I think that my problem is that it's gotten a little bit better, but it's just so annoying. I can't write without it going numb. Right, yeah. So usually that's going to be in your neck. And hopefully you don't have, yeah, hopefully you don't have a disc issue up in there. But, yeah, if you would uh, like the information on there and get this little coupon for $49, we could sure check you out. Okay. That would be no I, problem. I just have a terrible fear of having my neck popped. Yeah. I cannot abide even the thought of it. Yeah. And I know that you can to, uh, to chiropractic. Mm -hmm. and I've had acupuncture in my knee, mm -hmm. uh, so I'm a little bit familiar with some of that. But anyway, mm -hmm. I do need some help, but I'm not sure exactly where to go to get it, but I would like to try that. Okay. Uh, well, leave your information and we'll send you the information, and and I can, I can actually give you a call back, too. That'll be fine. Okay. One way or the other, we can help you out, okay? Okay. Now, where do I give the information? Uh, um, I think they'll get the information after uh, you sign off. We'll there. go to break and Gene will take your yeah. information. Yeah. Hang yeah, hang on the line and Gene will take some information and your phone number and I'll get back with you and we'll send you the coupon that we need to get you going with. Okay? Okay. All right, thanks for calling in, Deborah. And we'll go to a break. We're back. We are back. That's right. I've been, you know, I just sometimes I just listen to that music. I like the, I like that song. I picked that out. So, yeah. So uh, this show would not be possible without our sponsors. You're listening to It's Your Money Radio, where we help you make more money, save more money, and have more money for all of your financial goals. And I had a friend who said he'd call today. I don't know if he will or not. Greg, are you out there? You can call us. And, and he had a challenge to put on the air. But if he calls, you know, we'll... We'll hear from him, and if he doesn't, well, he had his chance. So. But uh, I wanted to thank uh, Gayla Scrivener for being our sponsor. And uh, Gayla is the owner of Scrivener Solutions. She and her team of virtual assistants, they're, they helped us get started here with our digital marketing. Uh, if you look at Facebook and all of our marketing that we do there, she does all of that. And uh, that you know edits our Facebook live feed and puts it on YouTube, helps get everything in line, uh, stores all of our media, uh, makes it easy to access and, and do anything with. So she's a big help to us. And Scripter Solutions is, our, is my personal assistant, and I recommend them to all businesses. They love to help you with your different media needs, for one, digital planning and digital marketing. Uh, virtual assistance is a great and cost-effective alternative for high-quality professional administrative assistance for the small business owner. So if you've never heard about virtual assistance or wonder if it's right for you, I encourage you to download Gala's free book, Five Things You Must Know Before Hiring a Virtual Assistant. Or visit the website, ScrivenerSolutions.com, ScrivenerSolutions.com, and download your free copy of the book. Or, uh, yeah, so get your free copy of that book and find out why, you know, what a virtual assistant can do for you. And she has a team of people, so they have a lot of different things they can do. They like helping you with your blogging and your communication with your clients and all that. Email lists and stuff like that. <coughs> very helpful. Mm -hmm. She is very helpful. All right. And last week, um, what was I talking about last week? I talked a little bit about um, Roth IRAs. Uh -huh. Okay, so Roth IRAs, and and the reason I was talking about that is because the tax, with the tax rates being lower next year, now if you're mm -hmm. getting ready to do your taxes, you know, your tax rate, nothing's changed yet. This is all things that are going to happen in 2018. But I thought Roth IRAs might be a viable alternative because a lot of people's tax, you know, marginal tax rates are going to be lower. Right. And uh, the other thing I like about Roth IRAs is because if, if you have a small business, and if you don't, you should. I mean, it's real easy to start a small business. I mean, I don't, I don't care if you, I mean, you can start, um, you know, like a Mary Kay or Amway or anything like that, and you can pay your kid 
mm -hmm. your child, okay, if they're eight years old, I don't care, you can pay them, you know, five hundred dollars a year. Yeah, to take out the trash. To yeah, pay them to clean the house because your house yeah. is your business now. So you can right. like pay them, pay them for that or pay them to hand out leaflets in the neighborhood or something mm -hmm. like that. Yeah. And that's a legitimate business expense, so you yeah. get to write that off. Mm -hmm. Okay, now that's income to your children, which aren't going to, they're not going to pay taxes on that income. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now if your kids have income, they can put that money into a Roth IRA, or mm -hmm. you can put it in there for them. When they take that money out in 50 years or so, they won't have to pay taxes on that money. Well, define a Roth IRA for me. What's, well, the, what's the tax benefit of that? Yeah, that's that's just a, you don't get a tax deduction when you put the money into a Roth IRA, but if you're, you know, if you're mm -hmm. a child, you're not going to need a tax deduction. You're right. not going to be paying any taxes. Mm -hmm. um, the adult gets a tax deduction because they're making a legitimate payroll expense. And uh, it's a, just another type of IRA where where it grows tax-free, tax, tax -free. not tax-deferred, tax-free, because when you take the money out of your Roth IRA, when you're... 59 and a half yeah. for a lot of reasons you can take it out earlier to buy a house or mm -hmm, mm -hmm. if you're unemployed and you need to pay for health insurance that sort of thing there's a bunch of exemptions why you can take that out and use it but when you get older and you're 65 and you're retired you can take that money out of your Roth IRA and it's tax-free income uh-huh so that's the big benefit you're not that's the big benefit. Already, you're not paying any taxes on the growth of that either are you you're not paying any taxes on it at all. That's that's good. Okay. <laughs> yeah. And that's where what I'm talking about here is you're talking about kids because what I'm talking about is the time value of money. Mm -hmm. And that's what people I have a hard time communicating with people and talking to them about the time value of money. And it's real easy to become a millionaire. And I can talk I can throw out some numbers. For example, Let's, let's throw out some numbers. I, I have some written down because I didn't have them last, last year, or last week when I was talking about it. But let's say you take $250 a month, mm -hmm. okay? And uh, so you're paying your kid maybe $6,000. What, what does that come to? $2,000, $250 a month? $2,400. Oh, $250 a month? $250 a month. That's $3,000 a year. Four, three, yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, uh, three thousand dollars a year. Now that's that's not a lot of money, mm -hmm. but if you think about everything you spend, I like to look at people's budgets because there's so many things we can easily spend fifty, sixty, a hundred dollars a month on. You break it down to weeks, and I, you know, I like to look at the vices. Do you smoke cigarettes? And I know you. I know it's impossible to quit, but hear me out. All right. Mm -hmm. If you're buying lottery tickets. Come on, you're probably not going to win. Um, mm -hmm. You can win the lottery if you invest that money instead. Mm -hmm. um, you know, just and if five you're dollar eating, coffees. Yeah, little five dollar coffees. Every if you're day. eating out a lot instead of making mm -hmm. a sandwich at home, I mean, take a keep close track of what you're spending. And I'm talking about two hundred fifty dollars. You know, fifty dollars a week. You know, mm -hmm. sixty dollars a week. Just ten dollars a day or less. Oh yeah, that's not a lot of money. Mm -hmm. And here's what you can do with $250 a month. You're paying it to your kid, you're putting it in their Roth IRA, mm -hmm. okay, which, which, like I said, is accessible for different things. For 50 years, and I'm, I mean, I'm really making one argument in absurdium here because uh, mm -hmm. I just want you to really get the idea of what we're doing. Okay, for 50 years, um, $250 a month for 50 years, that's $150,000. That you invest. That you've invested over 50 years. If you okay. would put that money in a bank and earn 1% interest on that money, mm -hmm. that 150000 becomes 190000 mm -hmm. Okay. A little over 190. I'm rounding. Mm -hmm. Okay. If you put that in the stock market, okay, now I know a lot of people are worried about the stock market, and it could crash, and it could go up, and there's a lot of things that could happen, but... Over, if you look at 30 year averages, <coughs> if you're looking at 30 year averages in the stock market, mm -hmm. I need a simple T here. <laughs> the 
the average rate of return is about 8% a year. If you can get 8%, yeah. Yeah, okay. I mean, just in the uh, S&P 500. Right. You know, you're looking at our Dow, yeah. Dow Industrial Average. And the, and the Roth IRA could be invested in mutual funds and everything else that's well, you know, averaging that 8% or whatever. Just, let's just say ETF because yeah. I don't like the MF word. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mutual fund. That's the <laughs> MF word. So let's just say you put it in a, just a, a, a you know, S&P ETF. You can mm -hmm. buy those. They're just yeah. index ETFs. Mm -hmm. Very low expenses. You can just open up an account at Scottrade and do it yourself. Yeah, yeah. Or you can talk to an expert like me and you can do it. And uh, so let's say you just put it in and you never look at your statement because you're going to have different returns every year. It's going to, mm -hmm. sometimes you're going to, you know, what happens, and this is what happens when people even do it. They'll look at it and then, you know, after, after 10, 15 years, they look at it and like, wow, I've got a lot of money. You know, if I could take that money out, I'll pay the penalty and the taxes, I could buy a new car. Maybe I need a new washer and dryer. Maybe I need a refrigerator. Maybe I just really, really need that money or just really, really want it. And you can take that money out and spend it. You know, so it's really, mm -hmm. it gets really tempting. Or maybe, you know, it's growing and it's growing and it's growing. And one year, one year you look at the statement and you lost 20% or 30% of your money. And you're just like, man, this just isn't working. I'm just going to quit this thing. It's not going to work. But, but trust me, over the, over the 50 year period, you know, um, historically, Average looking at the numbers, it's about eight percent a year. Mm -hmm. So let's just we're just saying eight percent, two hundred fifty dollars a month mm -hmm. for fifty years at eight percent interest. At eight percent instead of the money market instead of the one one percent you're getting at the, the bank. bank. Yeah, okay. It's almost two million dollars. Wow. Two million dollars. Yeah, so yeah. I mean, just look at all of those little habits you have, and yeah. all of those things that add up. And just make sure that you tie that up so the kid can't get it out early. Yeah. <laughs> and, you know, maybe you maybe you don't have any money. So maybe yeah. you're just like, well, maybe it's too late for you. Think about your children. Mm -hmm. Okay, you got two kids, $125 a month each. Mm -hmm. Make it $100 a month each. And you're still going to have close to a million dollars in their accounts when they retire. Teach it, them, talk to them about yeah. it, teach them to do it. That was 250, it's almost 2 million, so 100 and, yeah, 125, 125, you'd be pretty close. Pretty close to a million dollars, $125 a month for 50, yeah, 50 years, years invested yeah. in the market. Yeah. Almost a million dollars. Like I always say to my class, you know, when I used to teach and things, that mm -hmm. you know, anyone can be a millionaire, and if you can't do it, mm -hmm. Maybe your kids, you can do it for your kids, or you can teach your kids, or you can teach your grandchildren to do it. Well, it's a good way to teach them on some of the money-making principles yeah. that everybody needs to know. Mm -hmm. And the Roth IRA is one of the best ones that I like it. Or, sure. or as a lump sum, what were we talking about? About three thousand uh -huh. dollars. Oh, I do tax returns. A lot of people who don't have any money, they're going to get a three thousand dollars tax return. Yeah. Because they're getting earned income credit, child tax credits, they're getting all these credits. Mm -hmm. And if they, they took three thousand dollars of that money every year and put it in an account for their kids in a Roth IRA, yeah. right? That's almost two million dollars mm -hmm. tax free that their kids would have when they retire. Mm -hmm. Do you love your children? Do you want to do something for your children? Yep. I well, mean, and if you if you do it for your children, you've got to do it for yourself first. That's the way the easiest way for us to teach our children, yeah. and then they can carry that on to the grandkids and everything else. It's a win-win situation for everybody, if you right. ask me. So anyway, time value of money, that's, that's all I'm, I'm saying. And uh, if you want more information, you know, you want to talk to me, you want to give me a call, um, hey, you can give me a call uh, you know, here on the air, or you can call me at my office. My office number is... 417-763-3345 and we can talk about how to save a little bit of money, set it aside, look at different ways to do it and uh, how you might make your children mm -hmm. a lot better off than you are because that's the American dream and with that let's take a break. And welcome back to It's Your Money Radio where we help you make more money, save more money and have more money for all of your financial needs. And where does that fit in if we're talking about your health? I have Dr. Michael Miller here talking about your health and we're talking about a lot of things for you can do that's a lot less expensive than getting surgery and uh, or getting sick and uh, we know that getting surgery or getting sick costs a lot of money so we want to save you money by keeping you healthy 
and Dr. Michael Miller. And if you want to talk to him on the air again, 862-9977 is our number or 1-800-375-0056. If you want to call Michael Miller, ask him any questions, we're always willing to do that. So Dr. Miller, how can you save yes, people sir. money by keeping them healthy? Well, normally if you are healthy, you're not going to the doctor you're not going to have uh, any medication, so on and so forth. So it actually pays to stay healthy. And if you can use the technology that we have available, then by all means, why wouldn't you? Mm -hmm. And the technology that I mean is services of a chiropractic physician. Right. Because we know that if you have a functioning nervous system, that is communicating on how to do the job that it needs to do in your body, okay, you will be healthy. Now, if something is not communicating properly, then something is gonna be malfunctioning. So, if that's your kidney, if that's your liver, so on and so forth, you don't want that to happen. Yeah. So if you can keep yourself functioning from the spinal level and the nervous system level, you will be, quote, healthier overall. Right. And a lot of people, I think, don't realize that. And I, I know I've been doing chiropractic care for a long time. Mm -hmm. And uh, your body can heal itself if, you're, if it is functioning properly. And that's one right. of the things that people don't understand, just their spine, all the nerves, everything is controlled by your brain. That's right. right. And in order for your brain to control it, it's, you communicate, all the parts of your body communicate to you through your nervous system that goes through your spine mm -hmm. and into your brain. Correct. And if, you're, if your spine is out of alignment, not working right, then it could cause trouble anywhere in your body. That's exactly right. And as I teach the students when we have an anatomy and physiology course at OTC, and every organ when a baby is developing in utero every organ starts on the end of a nerve mm -hmm. and that's how connected our organs are to the nervous system <coughs> so again if the nervous system isn't working right and the inflammation isn't going back and forth properly to the brain then you've got a malfunctioning organ and that could be kidney could be liver, could be voice box, it could be the muscle in your leg. Something's not working. Right. And, and that's how chiropractic can help that get you healthier functioning for even for your liver problem. Right. By getting an adjustment helps your liver function better. And more and more your physician might recommend you to a chiropractor for care because more I think it's becoming something that physicians are more and more recognizing that chiropractic could be a way to treat a lot of the illnesses that they see. Is that oh, right? yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Um, a whole lot more of them are wising up to the idea and, and actually including them in their group practices. Okay. So if, if, if you find something wrong with you, your first instinct can be to go to the hospital we we'll go to the emergency room. Or go to the emergency room. That's what people do, right? They cost go to the you emergency room. A bunch room. of money. <laughs> right. Um, but why not go see a chiropractor when you're healthy? And if you're getting, how often do you say a healthy person should go in to see a chiropractor? Well, I usually get an adjustment at least once a week, whether I need it or not. Mm -hmm. But that's what keeps me healthy. Yeah. Because the more active you are and the more things that you do out there, um, you know, things just get beat out of uh, alignment, if you want to call it that. And, you know, some you bend over and some things don't straighten up like it used to, and so it gets out of place. It gets okay. stuck. And that's what the good thing about chiropractic is, is it will restore the normal function, be it the spine or any other joint, and then you can function better. And do you have special rates for people that are going to see you that often? Um, not special rates, it, you know, we keep the prices actually pretty low and most of the time your chiropractic treatment is lower than normal co-pays nowadays for insurance companies. So 
it's actually pretty easy to stay healthy again because if let's say if you wait until a certain problem like a pinched nerve gets bad enough where you actually have a numbness and tingling going on it's going to take a larger amount of care to get that fixed as compared to never getting it in the beginning in the first place so that's when you come in to get uh, regular care like on a maintenance kind of thing and that might be two times a month for some people it might be once a week for some people it might even be once a month for some people it just depends on what kind of shape they're in to begin with and they stay in that kind of shape they'll actually never spend as much as that rehab would cost so on a yearly basis or on a even yeah on a yearly basis if you got one adjustment twice a month okay let's say you spend a hundred dollars a month sure okay that's twelve hundred to keep yourself going yeah but if you didn't do that and you come into me that year later and you say yeah this thing started a, a year ago and but it's going to cost you two or three thousand dollars to fix it this year they might have to come in every day or every other day. Well, there's a lot of times I have a disc issue from a car accident, and, and we have to treat them every day to reduce the disc and get them to where they're functional so they can get off of disability and go back to work, so on and so forth. And it's going to cost you that two to $3,000 pretty easy. Okay, so, great. Well, if you have a question about chiropractic, give us a call at 862-9977 or 1-800-375. 0056. Uh, I wanted to thank a sponsor real quick, Rooney, McBride, and Smith, and they've been a sponsor from the very beginning of the show, and I really appreciate them. And we've spoken to them about uh, estate planning, uh, bankruptcy, uh, divorce. They, they do all different types of practice, all different types of law. Mm -hmm. I re refer friends, I refer clients, I refer family members to them. And I think they, they really do a fine job. Uh, they'll do an initial discussion with you over the phone. Uh, no charge, I believe, for everybody. So their number is 417-708-9681. Rooney, McBride, and Smith is a sponsor. And I wanted to talk about, uh, also, I wanted to talk about acupuncture. You do acupuncture, right? Yes, I do. Yes, so I do. <laughs> what, is, uh, what are some of the reasons people come to you for acupuncture? That's something I've never had done. Yeah. So I have no clue. A lot of times a, a patient uh, will start because of the pain control possibilities of it. It's amazing. And I've used it on patients that have a herniated disc. They're in so much pain they cannot barely get around. And it very, very is very powerful to help the person with pain control. Okay. So it's a good therapy as far as that's concerned. Um, of course, we can always use ice as far as the shrink of the swelling in an injury when there's swelling in a spine or in a case of a disc herniation. Um, but I'll tell you, the, the power of that pain control just for the needles in the area is amazing. And I've used it quite a lot for patients of that with that kind of a thing. So they come to you with a, a sore back or a sore yeah. muscle or you know part of their body being sore and you can do the you can do the chiropractic to help their put mm -hmm. their bones back in place and get everything fixed but in sure. the meantime you could do the the acupuncture to help them with the pain alleviate yeah. the pain. And yeah and sometimes I'll do the uh, acupuncture for about 10-15 minutes before they get their treatment and then I might do disc decompression techniques to reduce the disc that's bulged. And then while they're still laying there and feeling a little bit better, then repeat the, the acupuncture so that it'll help control some of the after treatment pain also. Okay, so if you're in pain, what's your number again? Makes a, makes a big difference. If you're in pain, the phone number is going to be 889. 417-889-2225. Ask for Dr. Miller at the Family Back and Neck Care Center. And remember, we're going to have a new address, 3100 East or South National. Okay, let's take a break. Thank you.
And you're listening to It's Your Money Radio, where we help you make more money, save more money, and have more money for all of your financial goals. Our number here on the air is 862-9977 or 1-800-375-0056. If you'd like to call and talk to Dr. Michael Miller, we're talking about chiropractic and acupuncture, and we can talk about nutrition if you'd like to talk about that. But, uh, Michael, during the commercial break, you were telling oh, me yeah. an interesting story. Let's... Uh, well, back to the acupuncture and how how good it is and powerful. But uh, the nicest thing about here at our clinic, since we do acupuncture and the chiropractic care, you can do a whole lot more for people. This case that I was talking about earlier was a gentleman here in Springfield that was actually referred to acupuncture by the pain control center because they didn't know what else to do. Well, he comes into the office and we started acupuncture. Okay, so as a last resort, he decides, let's try acupuncture. Yeah, they don't okay. know what else. And this man yeah. had so much pain, it was unbelievable in his neck and in his throat and, I mean, everywhere. It was just unbelievable. And he was on so many pain medicines that he could barely get around. And he was on disability, he couldn't work, he was only a young man of 30 some odd years old, but for some reason or another all this started happening, and the pain clinic didn't know. Anyways, he comes in, so we started acupuncture, just me doing the history, and I know that he's got a subluxation somewhere. He's got a pinched nerve based on his history. Right. We just got to find it. So. We actually did. We found it and we started chiropractic care probably two months or two weeks into his acupuncture care. Okay, so how did you find it? Do you do x rays? Yeah, you okay. do x rays, and it was the worst neck that I have seen in a long time. And it actually is a post, um, post auto accident kind of a neck. Okay, so first so of he all, had the history. if this person had gone to see you after their auto accident, never would have had it. Never would have been a problem in probably. the first place. So yeah, if you not. get in an auto accident, even if you don't think you have anything wrong with you, mm -hmm. give Doctor Mike a call and just go get an adjustment. Have him looked at you. Um, yeah, fix it before it gets bad. Because yeah. that's the same history that he and a lot of other folks always give us. You know, there's always some kind of an injury back then. They didn't think there, anything was wrong. Right. But this gentleman was so bad that uh, total disability, he could not work. And he had hearing problems. He had vision problems. He had everything. He was walking with a cane, so on and so forth, and just could barely get around. Balance was, and dizziness, he couldn't barely stand up. That's, I mean... So, you know, who, nobody yeah. wants to be on total disability. Uh -huh. You're not getting, even a total disability, you're not getting all of your income replaced. Mm -hmm. You know, so your family has less money to live on. Yeah. And, and you're in pain. It's yeah. not like you can sit home and enjoy that money. Yeah. You're, you're in pain. You're in agony. And you're yeah. spending money on doctor bills and everything else. Yeah. And, and you're so not bad. getting better. I mean, yeah. so he, come, so and he, he was, comes to you. he couldn't even drive. He had a hard time driving. <coughs> Sometimes he had to be driven to the clinic. So but anyways, right now he's, oh, probably six months now we've been treating him. And he went to work, okay, back to go. work okay. at his regular job. And So no more like, pain? No more, no more walking with a he's, cane? He's not walking <coughs> with a cane anymore. He's actually yeah, walking put your normal, on, let him know you're on. straight up, not bent over with a cane. Yes. You know. He's driving, he drove okay. himself yeah, to the family be gatherings be. over the Christmas holiday. Everybody was amazed that he's doing as well as he was, being at where they saw him before, where he couldn't do any of that stuff. And, uh, <clears throat> yeah, back working and doing his stuff. His pain is probably only at a level of one or two, very much more manageable. He's not on the medication that he used to have, and he's got another probably six or so months of regular treatment to do, although he's not doing it as often as he was in the beginning. So he feels better, he's healthier. Oh, and he, he told me the productive. last time, he said, he said, I know it's the adjustments that's doing it, you know. So, yeah, it's been a wonderful thing just to watch him, and he was very thankful. Gary is on the phone. Uh-huh. Hey, Gary. 
Hey, how are you guys doing today? Oh, it's Gary. <laughs> Gary Bigman. <laughs> how you feeling, Gary? I'm still under the weather. I'm hoping Mike's got some practical, uh, the whole thing to, uh, to feel better when the cold is a flu. With the cold and the flu. Oh, boy. Well, what I always mix up, with, especially with the sinuses, I always mix up a little bit of aloe vera gel in a little little squirter bottle and I put uh -huh. a couple of drops of some frankincense, some tea tree oil and uh, oh eucalyptus is always good too and then I usually put that in the, my nostrils and let it soak back in inside my sinuses and it usually clears up the sinuses and the head cold within a day. Okay, so you said that Yeah, and you, yeah, I take a, I take a aloe vera gel, you buy the aloe vera gel at Walmart, that's the clear stuff, and you get a, you get a little bottle, and if that little bottle's two ounces, you go 75% water, 25% aloe vera gel, so it is kind of liquid, and then in that little bottle, you would use probably 10 drops of each one of those essential oils. Uh, where do you, where do you get the essential bit. oils from? Well, I do the essential oils in my clinic, so okay. you can order them for me and or whatever. So you're saying he could go to your clinic and get the essential oils from you? Oh yeah, okay. oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, but this is just a it's a personal thing that I use, and it'll clear up. Yeah, you you lay back on your bed and put a little eyedropper, like a half an eyedropper, in each nostril and let that kind of sink back up into the sinuses oh yeah it'll it'll burn like you got into the pool water and sucked it up into your head but it'll clear it up in no time at all okay well i was looking for something natural rather than well that'll be natural <laughs> I, I, I have been taking the, the other stuff so uh -huh. uh, you know to try to get out, out of this well, if I'm sitting around, I'll, I'll put a, the frankincense or lemon uh, wow. on my tongue, you know, so the lemon essential oil, and uh, that'll do a big difference. Oh, what? The frankincense you sell is available to you. Oh, yeah. Well, that's what I'm asking. It's not a, I guess the frankincense I'm familiar with is the biblical frankincense. Yeah, same difference. But usually, yeah, if you don't want to use a, uh, essential oil, then I have the Boswellia herb in my clinic. Get okay, material? Because the Boswellia herb is the same Hello. as the frankincense. Oh, okay. Hello. Okay. So, yeah. And Boswellia is a really good antiviral herb, which will get you over your cold faster if you want to use herbs. Okay. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Well, we're at the uh, National. Going to be in National 3100 Na South <clears throat> National, and we're going to be opening there on the 5th of February. Okay. Right now, you can still call that same number, and you'll get the Sunshine Office. And yeah, and that's fine, but yeah, if you want to call that number, 889-2225, Gary, we can get you taken care of. All right. Well, I appreciate it, Mike. I was sitting there listening. I thought I'd give you a call. Good. Well, and we're glad to hear your voice, and we've just got a couple of minutes left here. Yeah, John, I'll let you go. Nice to talk to you, man. I'll be talking to you later. Thank All right. Talk to you later. Bye. So that was nice to hear from Gary. I'm glad, yeah, yeah. glad uh, they'll be feeling better with your remedy. You should mix a patch up for them and expect them to come pick that up, I think. <laughs> yeah. And uh, so we just wanted to close out the show. Thank you for your, to all our sponsors. And that was Gary Bingman, uh, A&D Mechanical Services, Plumbing, Heating, and Air Conditioning. 
if you want to give them a call, it's a 24-hour service, and don't worry if he's not feeling well. He's got a crew working for him that can come to your house 24 hours a day, anytime, if you give them a call at 866-8257. Uh, Dr. Michael Miller was here all day today. we we'll listen listening to him. You can reach him at Family Back and Neck Care Center. Ask for Dr. Miller when you give them a call at 889-2225. Uh, thank you to Rooney McBride and Smith at 417-708-9681. They, uh, they're attorneys and they'll help you with, uh, like I said, we talked about estate planning, divorce, bankruptcy. bankruptcy. Um, I guess, I guess any, you know, all kinds of things they do. I don't know all that they tickets, do. Speeding tickets, right, speeding tickets. That's right, speeding tickets. All those uh, types of things. As well. And uh, Gayla Scrivener, and she takes care of of uh, uh, small businesses that need a little help. Uh, she'll do all of your uh, online marketing and advertising, send emails to your clients to keep in touch, and that's always a good thing to do. And you can reach Kayla Scrivener at 501-9072. Uh, any last words? You said you had a coupon available. Why don't you tell them about that real quick? Yeah, you. if you want to call in to the uh, radio station and or call the number 889-2225 and we, you can get the discount if you ask for Dr. Miller we'll get you a coupon for $49 that includes your consultation your chiropractic exam and an area x-ray if it is needed all right and you're we're listening to it's your money radio I hope you tune in next week and give us a call and we will be talking to you about investing next week and about taxes. So thank you for listening. It's your money radio. We help you make more money, save more money, and have more money for all of your financial goals.